What's up, guys? NBA Talk. Happy New Year's to everybody. Monday, January 1st of 2018, baby. New year, new people, new things. Let's just get into it. Uh, we got a couple games, but no, I'm just going to talk about one game tonight. Just one for the new year. Um, this one was the Milwaukee Bucks versus Toronto Raptors. Toronto Raptors win it in overtime, 131 to 127. It was a very good game from top to finish, close. For the most part, it was Milwaukee Bucks. Um, Toronto started off pretty good in the first part of the first quarter, if that makes sense. The first quarter, first half of it, Toronto was doing some good things. And then the Milwaukee Bucks played some good defense and just climbed themselves right back up. And then continue on in the second quarter as well. And then it was kind of a tie going back and forth in the third quarter. Um, Milwaukee Bucks came out pretty good entering the fourth quarter. But Toronto Raptors and DeMar DeRozan playing lights out. We can finally say he has a 50-point game now. We can finally say that. At least I can say that now. He has a 50-point game. He was definitely the guy tonight. Uh, just doing a lot of stuff. A lot. He was shooting the ball. He was getting inside. Also, I have to point out the people in there. La Venetunas, uh CJ uh, Miles doing some good things. You got people off the bench doing some good things. Um, uh, that boy, Deion White. He was doing some good things uh, for this team. Um... But DeRozan was the guy. He was for sure the guy tonight. Getting inside the paint, shooting the three ball as he should now. He's starting to pick things up even more with the three. He was getting to the free throw line a lot. He was passing the ball pretty good. He didn't turn the ball over that much. He had more assists than Kyle Lowry, who also had a very good game tonight too. But I was very impressed with DeRozan. He, especially in a down stretch when they really need to get this game tied up. He got it for it. And then in the uh, overtime, it was DeRozan again, leading the team. That This is superstar level. This is superstar level that DeRozan needs to be. This is fantastic. And this is the guy you need for the playoffs. I say the Toronto Raptors making the playoffs. They're good on defensively. They're good on offensively. Good overall. So... Yeah, good job for the uh, Milwaukee Bucks. They had a lot of production too. Giannis doing his thing. Uh, of course, you got Eric Blesso. Um, and then off the bench, you got Ma Malcolm Bredon and Maker doing some good things for big man. Like, we've been waiting for him to make some promise. It's starting to look like he's doing some things off the bench. So, that being said, that's it. Let's just get into the stats. Um, first off, DeRozan, the MVP of tonight. 52 points, finally his first 50-point game, career high, 52 points, 5 rebounds, 8 assists, only 2 turnovers, 17 from 29 from the field, 13 for 13 from the free throw line, 5 for 9 from the 3-point range. A lot of production from DeRozan. He was definitely leaving it on the floor tonight. Uh, Kyle Lowry followed in pursuit, 26 points, 6 rebounds, 6 assists. He was 5 for 10 from the three-point range, 7 for 13 from the field overall. Serge Ibaka, not on the offensive end, but the defensive end. Like, like throughout parts of the game, he was doing some good blocks. Four of them he got 11 points. He was 5 for 19 from the field, 8 rebounds, 2 assists, 2 steals. And you got a couple people off the bench. Um, just a lot of people, uh, which I'm pretty much going to butcher their names. Um, got Fred. Um, putting up 11 points in 22 minutes. You got a lot of production from the bench overall. I'm just going to say that. <laughs> so that's it for Toronto Raptors. They shot 49% from the field, 42% from the three-point range, 40 rebounds, 25 assists. Just fantastic. The Milwaukee Bucks did some good things too. They did a lot of good things too. Playing defense, playing offense. Uh, Giannis, onto the Kumpo, 26 points, 9 rebounds, 7 assists. 9 from 18 from the field. You got Chris Milton, 18 points, 3 assists, uh, 3 rebounds, 2 steals. He was 7 for 17 from the field. Eric Blesso with 29 points, 7 rebounds, 3 assists, 4 steals. He was 5 3-pointers out of 7. 
And then off the bench, you got Malcolm with 15 points, six rebounds, two assists. Um, Maker with 16 points, four rebounds. He was he made three three pointers, which is absolutely good. Um, you got some stuff from Mike Della Dova playing 29 minutes just to play defense and pass the ball. He picked up 10 assists and five rebounds, which is fantastic. I wish he he could provide more of a three ball, like be more accurate. Even though he he shot 50 percent, two for four from the three point range, but. It is what it is. I'm just going to say it like that. Um, that's it. Um, Toronto goes 25-10, and 14-1 at home. So they're killing it at home, man. Killing it at home. While the... Let's see. Uh, the Bucks are 19-16. and 19-16 right now. So... Toronto Raptors uh, gained back the second the second seat for the Eastern Conference while the Milwaukee Bucks fall to sixth seat. So that's it. Peace.